What's up guys, today I'm going to teach you how to do a freestyle trick that I learned when I was very young, uh, but it, it's kind of complicated, not going to lie, it's kind of complicated, but once you do it, it's very easy uh, and, and you'll blow your freaking friends' minds. And I've actually done a video in the past uh, doing the first part of this trick, which is a primo or rail stand double flip, and uh, if you want to look that up, you can. It's kind of like the worst video ever because it was like four years ago and I didn't know how to talk to a camera. But uh, today I'm going to teach you how to do a primo or rail stand double flip back to primo, which is way harder and way cooler way cooler. It takes a lot of practice, but once you get it, uh, I promise this this is a freaking cool trick to do. Outside and inside. I'm going to stop talking. So, primo double flip primo. First things first, you want to okay, I'm going to I'm going to say primo. The technical term is rail stand. Uh, but the first thing you want to be able to do obviously is get into primo. And uh, once again, this takes a lot of practice, but just keep on trying it and you'll definitely get a feel for it. But uh, what I do is I put my, my front foot above the bolts and my toes hanging off just a little bit right there. And I have my back foot the opposite with my toes barely on the board right here. And with my back foot, I press down and with this foot, I kind of step up. And uh, so with my left foot, I ride regular. With my left foot, I stand on top of the board and then I bring my right foot up. And it looks just like this. Toes hanging over the board, back foot just like that. Push down, step up. That's how to do a primo. Keep on practicing that. Uh, that is the first step. You really just have to get a feel for it to, to learn how to do that part. So part two of this trick, there's like, there's really four parts of this trick, uh, but part two is you're in primo and you're balanced and uh, you want to do the double flip. So look at my old video to see how to do a double flip, but uh, I'm gonna do a quick little overview of it. Basically, you just put your back foot right here on the edge of the board and you press down. You do nothing with your front foot at all. You just press down and uh, give it enough pressure so that it kind of does a varial double flip. And once again, this is a very feely trick. It, you, it's very hard to understand unless you actually go outside and try it. But that's literally the mechanic of this trick. You're uh, you're in the primo and you press down with your back foot. And uh, I'm gonna demonstrate that. Looks just like this. That was kind of sloppy, but you get the idea. You just press down with your back foot, do absolutely nothing with your front foot, that's the key. Don't do anything with your front foot, and uh, jump up in the air, land on it. Keep on practicing that and uh, you'll get it. Now the hardest part of the trick is learning how to get it back to primo. Basically the only thing you need to do is push down less than you would for a primo or rail stand double flip. So I'm gonna show you what I mean. So I'm gonna get into primo, or her. That was not primo. So I'm in primo, like this. So I want to double flip back into primo. So I'm gonna to try to push down a little bit less than I would for a normal double flip. And I almost did it right there. So if you do that and it actually lands on the side like that and you just missed your foot like I did, you pretty much just did it. You just need to uh, keep on trying it and push down that exact same way every single time. So that time I pushed down too much. And this is the frustrating part of the trick is uh, you're really trying to figure out how hard to push down every single time. So it's really like a work in progress when you're trying to do this trick. I've only done it first try like five times in my life and I've been doing this trick forever. So uh, don't be discouraged if it keeps on over flipping or under flipping because it's very freaking hard to do. See, flip too much. Flip too much again. So the next try I'm gonna do, I'm gonna try to flip significantly less than I just did those first two tries. That was it. That was it right there. If you guys fall, it's very easy to just catch yourself like I just did. Uh, but that was a really good attempt on uh, the, the way to push down the freaking, what am I saying? That was a very good attempt on how hard I pushed down. So I'm gonna try to do that again and just stay on it and get balanced. Ah, that was it. This trick is all about trying over and over and over again and learning how much weight to put down on your back foot. There it is. Now from here, you can either push down like that or if it's on the side, since it's on the side and you know how to primo double flip already, you can double flip. Or if you're really cool, you can try to land back into primo, but that is uh, one in a million, not really. So I'm actually gonna try to land one more for you guys, uh, just so you can see my process of uh, how to land this, because this really is a trick that's hard to be consistent at, honestly, but uh, it is a trick that you, you definitely get a feel for once you just keep on trying it. And I've said that a thousand times, but I don't care. Uh. There you go. Oh, why'd I step off? Uh. A little less this next time.
There it is. I didn't really hold it that long, but uh, you get the idea, people. Okay? Alright, so that is my trick tip for uh, how to do that trick. Uh, once again, this is a very hard trick to get consistent at, but if you work on primos and primo double flips, it'll definitely be easier to do because you already mastered how to do the primo double flip, so you just pop a little bit less. And uh, once you figure out how little to pop it, it becomes way easier. So uh, keep on practicing, and uh, if you guys get this, tag me on Instagram or something so I can see your freaking progression. I hope you guys enjoyed that video, and uh, I'm gonna throw you in the trash. Actually, I'm gonna recycle you. Ew, there's a lot of food in here. I'm gonna regret this. Goodbye. That was disgusting. That was so gross.